That many dogs. I know, but we gotta get it done. Okay? Just a tiny poke. Yeah. So we haven't had breakfast yet? We've been there for three hours and we still haven't had breakfast? Let's go find something to eat. Darren and I are at the hospital. Darren needs to get some blood work done and he needs some x-rays. Blood work's a real challenge for Darren because he has so many sensory issues. But we have found a few things that help. So for starters, we waited till it was a good day for Darren. We've had the requisition for a few days, but we aren't in a rush to get it done. So we wait till Darren's having a good day. Watch your cars. What are you looking for? I am looking for the police. You're looking for the police? Right here, I'm going to open it. Oh. Okay. How come what I open it as a police car? I don't know. Do you want to look at it before we go in? Yeah. Okay. We're not going in it, we're just looking at the outside. Outside? Yeah. When we're walking into the hospital, I always make it that it's a comfortable walk for Darren so that if there's anything he wants to explore, he can have the time to do that do so think? that he's yeah. not feeling and under pressure as going? we're going into yeah. the hospital. Mm -hmm. well Police car looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Yeah. Can I go in? No, you can't go in. Uh, sorry. It does have sirens. And the ambulance. Are we going to look at the outside of the ambulance? What? You can't go in it. You can just look. What do you think? Can you grab one? Just one. Pull. What number do you have? Three, eight, eight, five, eight, eight, seven, three. Fifty-three. Fifty-three. There's no needles. Yeah, we're gonna have one needle. You're gonna be super brave. Yeah. You can be brave. Yeah. I know, but we gotta get it done. Okay. It Just a tiny poke. Uh, okay, can you take your sweater off, please? It will hurt. No, it'll be okay. No. Yes, you can. You're tricking me. See? You're tricking me. Yes, you can. Which it. arm should they use? None. You have to pick one. Both. Oh, this one. Which one are you going to pick? Both. You want two pokes? No, that would be silly. Which one? No, we'll get your x-rays done next. This one is this one. We also know that it takes a long time when we're at the come in to get stuff done. So we have the iPad to keep them busy. It's just myself. We don't have the other kids as a distraction, so hopefully it's going to go well for Darren. Right in Paw Patrol? <laughs> Paw Patrol helps everything, doesn't it? Remember, if we stay still, it doesn't hurt as much. <laughs> just a tiny little poke if we're still. You can do it. Darren also has so many sensory issues. So we're trying to balance that. So when we go in for the blood work, Darren likes to be swaddled like an infant. That gives him that extra pressure. So that helps calm Darren down while he's getting blood work. So when I go in, I'm going to ask them to swaddle him. And they're gonna look at me and say, don't you think he can do it a, a different way? Cause Darren is nine years old. He's small for his age, but he is nine years old. And they don't think that they should be swaddling a nine-year-old, but that actually provides Darren some comfort. So we're gonna get them to do that to help make this an easier process for Darren.
Next up is the x-rays. We did the hardest part first. One, two, three. Mm. Are you gonna do the turn? Mm. You've been waiting a very long time, haven't you? Yeah. Oh my turn. Did they call you yet? Yeah. Mm. Okay. So let's take some pictures of your knees. Do you want to come and lie on the bed? No, they don't have needles. No needles. No, I hate those too. Okay. So point your toes up to the ceiling like this. Yeah, that's great. Okay, yeah. lie down. Can you stay like? Can you lie down and keep your toes like that? That's right. Good job, Darren. Come on, big muscles, Darren. Come on. He can't. Yes. Because you haven't had breakfast yet. It took so long. Yep. How long were we there? The needles. How did that go? Hurt. It hurt? Yeah. Were you super brave though? Yeah. So you had your needle and then what happened? X-ray? Yeah. You did a great job. Yeah. And then... And we weren't allowed to eat breakfast before we came, were we? Yeah. So we haven't had breakfast yet? We've been there for three hours and we still haven't had breakfast? Let's go find something to eat. What do you want to eat? Everything. You want to eat everything? Yeah. Put it up and ready to go? Yeah! Let's get moving. So that went well. It did take a long time. It's been three hours. So we got in, we got the blood work done. Darren was upset, but we swaddled him and that did provide him comfort. So he was upset and he did cry, but it wasn't like he was having a huge tantrum and trying to get away. So I'm quite happy with the way it went. Ideally, I would like that he doesn't cry and he doesn't get upset, but we were able to get it done. And then we had to wait for x-rays and the wait was so long but he's got his x-rays done and now we're gonna go and get something to eat because all of this was done fasting because the blood work had to be fasting so we are going to go and get something to eat because Darren is hungry uh, yeah. what for? they're gonna call you number yeah what are you gonna eat and twigs that sounds delicious. Yeah. This. Mmm, milk. Milk and chicken and truck. Nice. And flat truck. Are you hungry? Yeah. I'm trying to take the offer. Are you? Nice job. Did I? Good job, Savannah. Basketball is an activity that really helps Darren regulate himself, so coming home after a stressful day and playing basketball is huge for him. You're taking turns. Keep going. <coughs> nice. 